Hello everyone. So uh, it's been a while, um, and I've got good news and bad news. Good news is I'm back, and because uh, I'm all done with exams now. And the bad news is I haven't got any of my old save games because I reinstalled my computer, and I forgot to back them all up. We do, however, still have SimCity because that's stored in the cloud, thankfully. So, um, without further ado, I thought we'd come back to uh, Prison Architect, and I thought we'd do something a bit different. Because we usually we have everyone, and I think we were going to have a high security prison. I thought we'd give it a go. So, uh, let's just get rid of that. I don't want that. Delete. Okay, so we've got eight high security prisoners coming in uh, about a day, so 24 hours, or 23 hours and 57 minutes. And I think it's about time we get working on this prison. So, uh, there's the planning thing. Ah, here we go. Now, hmm. But let's draw a little preliminary kind of design thing. Actually, I want to kind of get rid of that. Uh, would that do it? Where's zoning? I need zoning, don't I? There we go. Okay, this is what I'm going to do then. So we're going to have a little fence. Uh, let's go to that plan there. No, planning. Get rid of that. And a fence that goes up here, like that. Then we can extend it outwards a bit. Uh, something like that. And we can have kind of like double doors. There we go. If we start our prison about there. Okay, so if we make this... If we go... If we go 15 both sides. 15 meters, yeah. Okay, and if we go 20 meters across... Let's go 40 meters across instead. And we just cap it off like that for now. So we've got 41 meters across, and yeah, 20 across or whatever. Uh, f yeah, 40 meters across and like 30 something downwards. Okay, so in here, this will be our main kind of prison compound area. Um, let's see. I want to kind of put the offices outside. So if we have the offices kind of like over here somewhere, uh, we'll sort those out later. Um. Well, we've got to have the holding cell right near the start, so if we have like a holding cell over here combined with... That's quite a big holding cell, actually. Hmm. How big does a holding cell need to be? Uh, holding cell, holding cell, holding cell. 5x5, five five, that should be fine. Oh, that's a massive holding cell. <laughs> let's, uh, let's just cut it down in size for now. We do there. Decent sized. We have a little door there, and oh, what we can do is we have storage over here. If we have uh, storage there, over here we can have canteen and the kitchen. So if we make it about there, that looks good to me. And we can have the kitchen like kind of here. And we can expand this downwards. That looks good to me. And the kitchen can move, expand downwards as well. Okay. Um, do you have this big open area here? I think we might just keep that open. And now we need cells and we need showers. So if we have a cell block that goes across here. Is this big enough? That looks good to me. Let's actually extend that one. Oh, 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 wait a second. Let's just shrink that. God, gotta love this planning tool. Um, actually, that's a bit awkward size. Let's make this bigger. Let's make this longer. And let's just draw the cells on the outside, and then we can build the bit in the inside first. Uh, next, sorry. Should we do. How many is this? One, two, three, four, five, six. If we get seven here, looks good to me. Okay, so there's half our prisoners. Um, just cap this off here. And there. And if we have another set of cells that go this way. 
It's starting to look a lot like one of our older prisons, actually. We could just do... We could do that, actually. I don't know, though. I mean, I've never done this before. It means all the prison cells are on the outside. Could be... No, we gotta we got to have them in the kind of wing-style things. Okay, did I make this long enough? Ah, oh, yes, beautiful. Just cap those off like that. Uh, not cap those, and the, uh, cut... Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay, so this, this would give us a capacity of 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, and we could have a little yard there. Uh, shower block, actually. I forgot about showers. Hmm. We could do... Nope, let's not do that. Here we go. If we have a shower kind of block there... Yeah, that looks good. And we have the yard here, starting off. Prisons here, prison, prisoners here, prisoners here. And then we can wrap this around to go upwards like that. And we have a little kind of like area. That looks, sounds good to me. What do you guys think? So this gives us a holding cell, storage, kitchen, canteen, cells, and a shower thing. Um, so if out here we have... Actually, maybe we should put them along here. That might not be a bad idea, actually. They need to be 4x4? Four four? Officers need to be 4x4, four four, don't they? God, it's been a while since I've played this game. Uh, office? I don't even see office. Uh, office? Have I just gone straight past it? Where's office? Oh, there it is, yes. Yeah, 4x4. Four four. <laughs> Bit blind there. So, 4x4 four four would be... Like that, wouldn't it? 4... Nope, I went one too far. There we go, and if we just make another one of those. Like that. So there's two officers, I think. Yep, two officers. And... Because th these guys don't need to really go in the prison at all, do they? Oops, one too far there. That's too short. There we go. They just chill on the outside. Okay, that looks good to me. Right, should we get this going then? So we need fences on the outside, because they're free. There we go. Now, with um, Alpha 10, I can't remember if I played Alpha 10 last. Um, ooh. Bit of lag there. So with Alpha 10, you can now get prisoners to work on stuff. So you've got, uh, let's take a look. We've got cleaning cupboards. We have laundry, and we've got the workshop now has been changed. And so we can make, we can force them to make um, license plates, which I think would be a really good idea. I mean, we should turn this into a uh, labour camp. I think all these hard security, uh, high security uh, prisoners. They kind of need to pay back society a bit there. Right, so let's fast forward this as fast as it will go. And yeah, I guess we just have to wait this out. I might just, you know, pause the recording here and come back when most of it's done. I think that might be a good idea. Save you, like, boringly watching just a bunch of workers put up a fence. So, um, yeah, I'll see you guys in a few moments. So, hello. Welcome back. Um, this is This is how it's looking now. We're pretty much all done here. Uh, laying out the beautiful grass. Need to sort of electricity in there. But apart from that, we've got a functioning prison. Oh, and the showers. Forgot about that. But, um, uh, no, I don't want bang up. We do have one problem. We we can't have more than two guards right now because apparently that exceeds the daily budget. So, uh, we need to hope we get a budget when these prisoners arrive. Otherwise, we're only going to have two guards. Which I don't think is sufficient, <laughs> considering we're going to have eight high security prisoners. Uh, roaming these prisons. So let's uh, let's lay down this yard. I still haven't done that at least. All oh, right, he wants to have a fence around it, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, we'll do that, and then we can put a door on it. And we can yell out. Let's put you back in slow for a few seconds. Just get the shower sorted. 
There we go. Okay, I think it's everywhere. Right, so let's take a look at our schedule while we're here. I did get one of the grants, by the way, but only one. So it's going to shower time when they get here. Well, about free time when they get undone. Um, let's put let's put a work section here. Give them some even free time. Give them a bit more work. Uh, work. Give them free time there. Free time, eat, morning free time, sleep. There we go, that sounds good to me. Now, the problem is we haven't got a accountant, so we can't actually tell them from the money we're coming, that's coming in. So I guess we'll have to get that research in. Um, can we get... Oh yes, we can get another two guards. Good, we need those. I think we should be alright with four, to be honest. Now I did put metal detectors here to beep at anyone that goes through. This one appears to change shape, but I don't know. Uh, probably a little bug there, but hopefully it still works fine. I think that person has a weapon. Anyway. So, uh, oh, guys, come on, get this. What? Where's that sink? Why haven't they done the sink yet? Oh, they have. Just hasn't got water. There we go. Just a tangled mess of wires and electricity down there. I did put a valve here, just in case. Oops, uh, wrong screen. Just in case we have an issue in here, because this water and electricity can spark like uh, electric stuff. What? No. I don't want any of those. Why do you keep stop switching on? Oh wow. Six years for torture. Hmm. Right, so, oh, I forgot about, I've put Fog of War on. Hmm. Where, is that a capacitor? Why is there a capacitor in there? I don't want a capacitor in there. Huh? <laughs> Just make sure we switch all these on. Now we actually need to give this place a kind of Jewett jail door here. We just get a double one right there. There we go. Okay, now you even get the prisoners' windows. Isn't that nice? So we need to get the CCTV pretty fast because I really want to see what's going on in the rest of the prison. So uh, while we're doing that, we should probably outfit our next office. How are we doing for money? Four grand. Could do a bit more, but it's better than nothing right now. We do have a bunch of grants we can take advantage of. Like, stop! No! Why does he keep switching on to bang up? I don't want bang up. Oh, it's annoying. Whoa. What happened there? Is my electricity out? Um. Oh, oops, oopsie. That's uh, no. There we go. I don't want to build a wire on top. There we go. Now I'll fix our electricity problems. Ah, yes, I completely forgot about um, drains. Just there we go. That should sort that out. Y you guys gonna go and you know? Oh, you need to wait for a guard to open it. That's annoying. Oh, acting suspiciously. Let's search uh, Simon Whiteman. Murder and manslaughter.
Oh, we had a knife. That's our first one. Right, looks like we have to extend this electricity a bit, uh, a bit more forward or backwards, whichever direction you're looking at it. Um, so we can make sure we can light up the whole room. Be very helpful. Oh, CCTV deployment. Get those. Bunch of lot. We have a lot of fat prisoners. Look at them. These guys are huge. Dave Hangman. <laughs> After his first breakthrough gig as a guitarist of the band Ripper Violence, he became addicted to meth. He used his guitar strings to strangle his two roadies. After that, he only played shows in his bathroom for himself, naked. Wow. <laughs> Sounds like an interesting fella. Did he actually get done? Yep. Yeah. Attempted murder, violent disorder, and assault. Not too far off the description. <laughs> uh, where actually are my guards? Someone go stand in there. No, oh, please don't come out here. Why do I have tons of power switches? I haven't got a single power switch. I, I, what? <laughs> I don't want any power switches. Here we come along mm, slowly, sadly. Very slowly. Um, let's set up this other office as well. Where is. There we go. And so this will be for our security officer. So we can get a CCTV, because I think you actually need the security guy for that. You need to think where we want to put those room, that room. Probably inside the prison, actually. Well, we could put it outside again. Well, no, inside, because you need to have a guard in there, don't you? So we want to make sure he's close by to respond to any issues in case, you know, we need... We're stuck with something. Are they just milling around? Guess so. Come on, inside you go. Where are you going? Wow. Great start. Okay. Let's just speed things up a little bit now. So, we're really just sitting on waiting for uh, the research now to really change things. Or uh, make things improve the prison. <sighs> Got lots of words there. Can you stop? What? No, no one's in the yard. Please go see where the prisoners are. Thank you. And what? No, inside. God, worst guards ever. I think we are screwed. If our guards gonna keep laughing like this, I know they're gonna go open the door, but they just always want to wander outside. Ugh. Can you knock us under the doorway? Yes. Okay. Oh, we got one done. We got the uh, finance done. So let's get a accountant. Poof. Okay, so we're making four hundred and four dollars a day. Hmm. That isn't sufficient, really. Let's see, where's work labor? Prison labor is down in maintenance. Okay. So if we go down that tree and then we just use a bunch of grants to uh, to pay for it all. Um, while, they're, while the workers aren't really doing anything, we should probably expand our prison out now. So let's just kind of do this. 20 meters? 20... Hmm. 24 meters, that's compromise. And 24 meters there. All the way up. 24 meters across. Just tidy there. Okay. So we're halfway. Uh, we extend the prisons. We're gonna kind of make the prisoners go up, as I mentioned before, kind of like that. And I guess I want to keep kind of leave this area open for canteen expansion in the future. So I might. Let's see. 
if we were to have more cells here, let's just kind of do something, just roughly, first of all, so we have a look, guidelines. Okay, there we go. So if we now have, so we have one more cell that goes like this, then the next cell is like that. I guess what we want to do is we would want to uh, it's actually one too big. That's fine. Just, there we go. I think the best way would be to just do something like that. There we go. Hold on. It's there. Yeah, like that. Are uh, these too big? Yeah, these are way too big. Don't want to give the prisoners too much room, now, do we? Okay. There we go. Oh right, there is only one. oh, I like to have two-way paths, you know, two gap paths there. So let's just redo this. Okay, oops, missed. There, there we go. So we just do this. And this looks like a good plan, I think. We'll just do this there. And this should give us tons of prison capacity for quite some time. Well, well, for a little bit anyway. And then over here, I guess we'll have like kind of extended onto the building. Or we'll have a little gap, shall we? One. Okay. Nope. Didn't mean to do that. We'll have like a little work area over here and laundry over there as well. Something like that. But I think we'll end it there for the day. For the day and we'll come back to this later but that that's our current plan and so next time we come back we'll get some money hopefully we'll have prison labor unlocked and cameras and we'll just sort that out first of all that's really key because if we can get the labor and we can get tons of money and all that jazz which would be very very helpful so uh, i'll see you guys later have a good one